just made a little fenced in area mostly for the moms not for the babies because the babies can get in and out of this so easily there you go <laughs> babies can get in and out very quick um, but the moms cannot and wherever the moms are is where the babies will go so they're all kind of getting used to each other this is the the first time that the moms have been with each other and the babies have all been to, with each other. Oh, Piper's little girl is the loudest little thing. She is so obnoxious. Uh, they're going to get out their aggression with each other. This little boy right here with the blue eyes, he is going to be staying with our herd. We are going to turn him into one of our um, our breeding bucks. And actually, Piper's little girl, the little loud mouth over there. Oh goodness gracious, she's going to be staying with us also. And then Ruby's little girl that black white and beige one she's going to be staying with us we are keeping two girls and one buckling out of the seven babies that we have right now <laughs> i wish these babies couldn't get out but this net is not electric electrified so as long as they're not getting zapped they will be uh coming in and out It's okay, lady. Lady, it's all right. Where are you two going? So these are the two that we're going to be keeping. Lady, no. These two are registered. Uh, Ruby's little girl is not registered, but we just love her coloring. And Ruby's always been a really good milker. So we figured we would um, just try her out and, and see how the milking goes it's not a very big fenced in area that I decided to do just um, to the back of this little shed area or barn area whatever you want to call it and then came in and then I go to the front where uh, I didn't go past the door that way we can easily get inside that shed and easily get inside that shed over there and oh, she's Hey friends, Jennifer here with Moreau Family Farm. Thank you guys so much for stopping by the channel today. I almost said thank you for stopping by the farm. It feels like that sometimes, but thank you guys for being here. We always love having you with us. I have done something a little fun today, so I hope that you guys enjoy watching this. Um, these, <laughs> I'll show you what's going on. They're all just in the fence, out the fence, running around, jumping around, having a good old time. They have all been cooped up for some time, so most of them are out. Only, oh, here we go. Now they're starting to come back in. Mama says, get your butt in here. Y'all, Bella is on top of the milking stand right now, and she is doing amazing. She still has not produced any milk. Um, I don't know if I'll be able to get a, a glimpse of her udder, but she is doing really, really well. Um, oh gosh, I need to clean off Piper's tail. We are not milking her yet. The only one that we are milking at the moment is Hope, and she's giving us about two cups um, twice a day, so four cups total a day, or a quart. Um, yeah, she's doing great. This is one of our bottle babies. She thinks I'm mama. And then the other bottle baby. And then this guy here, he's the bottle baby. 
What are you doing? Oh my goodness, knocking down the tin. Piper. Whew. But the only thing we have to be careful for are hawks. So hopefully if a hawk comes by, uh, mama will start calling for their kids and the kids will go back in and be safe with mom. Where are you going? Hey, where are you going? Get back to your mama. She's cute because she's got a little white spot on the side of her. And believe it or not, that is exactly what Piper looked like. When she was little, she looked just like that. And now she is like light tan. Light, creamy, tan, and white. But that's it. I just wanted to share that with you guys to let you know that we are getting the kids out to play with each other and to get to know each other and the moms are all together. They don't have a big area to forage, but that's okay. They'll go out in the pasture soon. But for right now, they're just getting out a little bit just to kind of stretch their legs and have some fun. I hope you enjoyed this and until next time, you guys be blessed. We'll see you then. Bye guys.